I'm a pilot, and uh, <laughs> of course sight is critical. Um, you can't fly without it. And gradually I was losing my sight and didn't realize how badly it was. Uh, and when, after the surgery, the difference is dramatic. I can see things that I never, you know, we have on, on our, on our um, heads up on our displays, we have traffic that's, a, that's indicated on our displays. And I could see traffic on the display, but I'd never see it. But now I see traffic out in the display, and I look up where it is, and there it is. So it's a big difference, and uh, much, much better for piloting. And for, for everything that I do, I build airplanes as well. It's been, it's been dramatic. I can see so much better. Um, at nighttime, I could see like a hawk uh, when, when the light is lower. I had a friend of mine that had been, seen Dr. McCabe, and uh, he suggested I come down here. And that was the best thing I did. Yeah. She's great. Every time I was in one department, I felt like I was the only person there in the whole building. And then they did 110%, I went to the next department and so forth and so forth. They handed me off and, and even going into the operating room, I felt like I was the only one there. Did a great job. The I associates and all your associates that are working with Dr. McKay, all of you are a top drawer. You know, it's been an incredibly positive experience. So, I think your patients shouldn't have any problems. That was the most anticlimactic thing that I've ever been through. <laughs> I, I thought that I was, even after I was handled so well, I, I was concerned. And um, once you guys got me in here, again, I felt like I was the only person here and the whole, the whole building was working for me. And. Um, uh, I remember Dr. McCabe said, all right, I want you to look at the, this light now. And I looked at the light and she said, okay, we're done. It was over. I should have done it sooner.